Now, if you are planning on selling the product yourself, you are going to have to have a sales letter. Now, creating a sales letter is quite a complex process. It really is an art form. And to be really honest, it's way beyond the scope of a program like this. It's an entire product all by itself. So we're going to talk about sales letters, but not about creating them because it's way beyond what we can cover in this course. Now, if you are selling the product yourself, you have to have a sales letter to sell. Now, there's lots of ways you can do this. It could be a video sales letter, it could be a long form sales letter, a short sales letter, and so on and so forth. It's entirely up to you what you want to do with it. Now, if you are selling rights, then having a sales letter is going to add some value and it's going to ensure that people use it. You know, if you're selling master resale rights, people aren't going to want to go out and create their own sales letter, really. If you're selling PLR, yeah, people may want to create their own sales letter, but if you give them a sales letter, it makes the entire package that little bit more valuable. Now, you can either create it yourself or you can outsource it. It depends upon your budget and your skills. Now, if you are going to outsource it, expect to pay a premium for a high quality sales letter. You know, for the top notch copywriters, you're talking sort of five to $12,000 for a sales letter you know that's a lot of money but then these sales letters can make a million dollars in a day so you know you can expect to pay a huge huge premium for quality sales letters though saying that on the lower end of the market you can get someone to write one for sort of two three hundred dollars but again it's not going to be the best in the world but it will be a start you know if you really can't do a sales letter and you're really not confident at least you'll have one and it will convert and then you can sort of test and track and perhaps improve it a little. If you want to make money, a sales letter is gonna to have to be good. End of story, it's gonna be good. Uh, if it's not, then you're not gonna convert. Um, now, if you're planning on doing it yourself, you're gonna to have to go and invest in some training. There are plenty of materials out there that will show you exactly how to create high quality sales letters. If you go and do a sort of a search, go and look at some of the reviews, you'll find some that will do. Now, what you can do is once you've written your sales letter is, you know, obviously it's going to convert at a certain rate, but you can improve that conversion rate by testing various components of your sales letter. So this means you do things like, uh, for example, you test different headlines, find out which headline produces the best results. You may test different... Um, openings, different closings, different price points, etc, etc. There's a lot of different things you can test to really sort of maximize the conversion rate of your uh, of your sales letter. Now again, that's a subject, whole subject by itself that we are not going to cover in any more depth than this because frankly we haven't got time in this video series. But it is an entire pro program all by itself. So make sure you test the various components to maximize your success and your profits. And basically practice is gonna help you to get perfect. What people recommend is that you, um, you know, go and look at some high quality sales letters that are performing really, really well, analyze them, work out, um, work out why they're working and you know, use those as inspiration. Other people say write out high quality sales letters by hand time and time again. And that's really, really going to help you understand how these sales letters work. Whatever you choose to do, you know, just you do something because, you know, the more you practice, the better you become, the better you become at writing sales letters, the more you will maximize your income from your information product. So, you know, make sure you have a sales letter and uh, make sure that it looks really, really good because basically your sales letter is what's going to help you to make money with your product. A poor quality sales letter will basically mean you are going to struggle to make any money. So make sure it's as good as you can make it.